Hi everyone, um, I got two unbo personal unboxings that I want to do today. I know there's already hundreds of videos on YouTube, but I didn't really have a chance to open these personally. Uh, I was just waiting for the right time, so I guess now I feel like opening them. These two, the limited edition Spider-Man controller and the uh, shells for the system. So I can't wait to personally see these finally in person. If you guys ask, like, why you guys, what do you gotta keep it closed for two months? But uh, I guess I was just, like I said, waiting for the right moment, and I guess now it is. Uh, let's start with the controller. So let's do it. So I'm just gonna open the controller first. So I, I like the design of the box. I think it looks really cool. Hopefully the controller actually looks good. So, I, I played the game by the way, I got the Platinum and everything, I think it was a really good game, but personally not my game of the year, I want Final Fantasy 16 to win, but I guess we'll see, right? So I'm just gonna open this. <sighs> okay, so when you open it, you got the controller in the bag, so let's take this out. It's right here. Ready? Whoa. Oops. Here it is. Wow. This looks really cool. I kind of wish I used them this when I was playing uh, Spider Man, but wow, this looks amazing. Wow. Yeah, it turns on. This is really cool. Okay, I give the design a 9 out of 10. I think this looks really good. I'm a huge fan. Okay, I guess next up is the actual shells that I'm mostly excited for. I don't think I'm going to use this because I don't want to dirty, dirty it up. Uh, I want to try and keep this pristine as much as I can. I also own the PS4 Pro. Uh, Spider-Man like back in 2018. I think that was a really good like system as well I was really glad that I held off getting a pro. I already bought like the original PS4 uh, back in uh, 2014 and I just stuck with it till when I got the Spider-Man edition, so we are gonna take a look at this. I'm just do a quick cut right now Sorry for the quick cut. Uh, I just want to put it back in the box, so I'll, I just keep it pristine as much as I can. <laughs> okay, up next is this. I can't wait to see this. I didn't like see this in person at all, and I already took off the tape when I first bought it because I just that's the most nerve wracking part. So I got it over with. I'm not selling it or anything like that. So this is for my personal uh, collection. So let's open it. This is a really big box. So let's open it. Oops. I don't want to rip the box or anything like that. Oops. It just doesn't want to come out. I'm just going to quickly uh, cut this for a second. All right, we're back. This was really stuck in there. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> I remember, by the way, I remember when I first got this, when they announced it back in July 28th or so, before the game's release, they wanted to release these accessories on September 1st. I shit you not, this, the controller was easy to get, but this thing was a pain in the ass to buy. It took me almost a month. I actually managed to place an order on Best Buy on like August 27th or something like that, a couple days or a few days before release, I was very, very, very lucky to get one. They only had eight left on the website. How I know there was only eight left is I follow a Discord server that keeps up with stocks and all that, so, so I had to keep notifications on for that. So let's take a look. Okay, so it's just a white box, by the way. Yep, just 
plain white. Okay, let's take a look. Okay, I'm gonna take this side first. Inside is just plain foam padding, which is really good. So let's take a look. So this is the disk drive side, so I can't wait to see this. Oh, it has a matte feel to it. Wow. Oh, I don't want to get my fingerprints on this. Wow, this is sick. Yeah, this is, I mean, this, it kind of looks like black with just the spider logo on it. I wish it was in the center, but yeah, this is the most boring side, but this still looks good. And here's the back of it. Yeah, okay. Just going to do another quick cut for a second. All right. Now we're going to take the last one out. There it is. This is probably the best looking side so far. Okay, I'm going to show you guys first before I see it. Yeah, this also has a nice like matte feel to it. Wow, this is definitely the best looking side. Wow, this is amazing. Wow, this is actually really good. I wish the other side was like that too. You know, I give this side a solid 10 out of 10. I like the small spider logo. With the tendrils with uh, of the symbiote, yo, this is amazing. Would I say it's worth the troubles of buying this within the span of one month? Probably, maybe, probably. I would say yes. Yeah, I would say yes. This looks really cool. Always wanted to get another a Spider-Man PS5 to complement my PS4 Pro, and this is it. I'd say. If you guys still can buy this, I'd say do it. But other than that, it seems like this is an impossible product to buy now. In like today's age, like around November 3rd or 2nd today, this is practically impossible to buy. So you got to do eBay or some sorts. But yeah, here's the back side. Other than that, that's everything. Thank you guys for watching and uh, stay tuned for more stuff. Bye-bye.